Welcome to Healthy Vegan Living. I'm your host. My name is Gary. This podcast is for anyone who wants to inquire about the vegan lifestyle. Tune in to episode 41, Mindful Heating. Check out the end of this podcast for a special question about this podcast. What mindful eating techniques can enhance the experience of vegan meals by fostering a deeper connection with the act of eating, leading to greater enjoyment and satisfaction from meals? Here's how. 1. Heightened Sensory Experience Mindful eating encourages individuals to pay attention to the colors, smells, textures, and flavors in each bite, which can make vegan meals more enjoyable and satisfying. 2. Improved Digestion Mindful eating, which involves eating slowly and chewing thoroughly, can aid digestion, allowing for better absorption of nutrients from plant-based foods. 3. Increased Awareness Practicing mindfulness while eating helps individuals become more aware of their body's hunger and fullness signals, which can prevent overeating and promote better portion control. 4. Emotional Well-Being Mindful eating can help break bad eating habits and build new, healthy ones, leading to an improved mood and a more positive relationship with food. 5. Ethical and Environmental Reflection Mindful eating aligns with the vegan philosophy of compassion and sustainability by encouraging reflection on the journey of food from farm to table and the impact of food choices on the environment and animal welfare. 6. Non-judgmental food choices. It promotes a non-judgmental attitude towards food, allowing vegans to enjoy their meals without guilt or distraction and to treat themselves without restrictions. 7. Healthier Food Choices By becoming more in tune with the body's signals and needs, vegans may find it easier to make healthier food choices that align with their ethical and health goals. 8. Stress Reduction Mindful eating can serve as a tool for stress reduction, providing a moment of peace and presence during meals, which can be particularly beneficial in a busy lifestyle. By incorporating mindful eating techniques into their meals, vegans can enhance their overall eating experience, leading to a more mindful, healthful, and ethically aligned approach to their diet. Not all vegan products are healthy. What should vegan watch out for excessively containing sugar and oils? Vegans should be mindful not to be distracted from the health benefits of a plant-based diet. Here are some key points to consider. Excessive sugar. Processed vegan foods. Vegan products such as desserts, Candies and sweetened beverages can contain as much sugar as their non-vegan counterparts, contributing to health issues like obesity and heart disease. Hidden sugars. Sugars can be hidden in various forms, such as syrups and sweeteners, in processed vegan foods. It's important to read labels and be aware of ingredients like sucralose, aspartame, saccharin, and neotame. Impact on health. Excessive sugar intake, regardless of the source, can increase the risk of developing medical issues such as heart disease and obesity. Excessive oils. Hidden oils in packaged foods. Many vegans, plant-based, Foods contain oils, which can add extra calories and potentially lead to weight gain. Oils are high in calories, with about 120 calories per tablespoon. Types of oils. Some oils, particularly those high in omega, six fatty acids like sunflower, safflower, corn, and vegetable oils, 
may increase the risk of chronic health conditions such as heart disease and type 2 diabetes. Healthier oil options. Healthier oils for vegan cooking include avocado oil, extra virgin olive oil, and cold-pressed oils, which provide essential fatty acids and vitamins. Recommendations for healthier choices. Read labels. Vegans should read nutrition labels to understand the content of sugar, salt, and fats in products. Limit processed foods. Limiting ultra-processed foods can reduce the risk of heart disease, diabetes, cancer, and other conditions. Choose whole foods. Emphasizing unprocessed or minimally processed plant foods like fruits, vegetables, whole grains, nuts, and seeds can help maintain a healthy vegan diet. Healthy fats. Opt for sources of healthy fats such as nuts, seeds, avocados, and plant-based oils that are low in saturated fats. Balanced diet. Ensure a balanced diet that includes a variety of nutrient-rich plant foods to avoid deficiencies and promote overall health. By being vigilant about the sugar and oil content of vegan products and making informed choices, vegans can enjoy the full health benefits of a plant-based diet. How can vegans identify unhealthy ingredients in vegan products? Vegans can employ several strategies. 1. Read nutrition labels carefully. Check for high levels of sodium, sugars, and saturated fats. Products with excessive amounts of these are often less healthy. 2. Look for whole food ingredients. Choose products with ingredients that are easily recognizable and minimally processed. Avoid those with a long list of additives or unfamiliar chemical names. 3. Avoid artificial additives. Steer clear of artificial colors, flavors, sweeteners, and preservatives. Common additives to avoid include carrageenan, methyl cellulose, and certain emulsifiers like xanthan and gourd gum, which can cause digestive issues. 4. Check for allergens and controversial ingredients. Some vegan products may contain allergens or controversial ingredients like gluten or soy. Also, be wary of ingredients like castoreum, shellac, and certain forms of vitamin D3 that are animal-derived. 5. Be cautious with fortified foods. While fortification can help prevent nutrient deficiencies, it's important to ensure that the fortifying agents are vegan-friendly and not excessive. For example, some forms of vitamin D used in fortification are derived from animals. 6. Limit ultra-processed foods. Highly processed vegan foods can be as unhealthy as their non-vegan counterparts, containing high levels of additives, preservatives, and artificial ingredients. Opt for less processed options. 7. Research ingredients. If you encounter an ingredient you're unfamiliar with, research it to understand its sources and effects on health. This is particularly important for less common additives and new ingredients on the market. 8. Use trusted resources. Websites like the Environmental Working Group, EWG, provide guides on food chemicals and additives to avoid. These resources can help identify potentially harmful ingredients in vegan products. By applying these strategies, vegans can make informed choices about the products they consume, ensuring they align with both their dietary preferences and health goals. What are some common unhealthy ingredients found in vegan products? Some common unhealthy ingredients are highlighted including 1. 
Processed oils and fats. Many vegan products contain high levels of processed oils and fats, which can be high in saturated fats and calories. These include ingredients like expeller pressed canola oil. Two artificial additives. Some vegan foods contain artificial colors, flavors, sweeteners, and preservatives, which can be harmful to health. Three high sodium content. Many processed vegan foods, such as fake meats and vegan cheeses, are high in sodium. Which can contribute to high blood pressure and other cardiovascular issues. Four, sugar. Excessive sugar can be found in vegan desserts and sweetened vegan products, contributing to obesity, diabetes, and other health problems. Five, starches and thickeners. Ingredients like starches. Gums and pectins are often used in vegan desserts to achieve a desirable consistency, which can increase the sugar and calorie content. Six refined grains. Some vegan products use refined grains instead of whole grains, which are less nutritious and can affect blood sugar levels. Seven non-vegan additives. Some ingredients. Such as vitamin D3 from lanolin, gelatin, and certain emulsifiers and glazes derived from animals, can inadvertently be included in products marketed as vegan. Eight, propylene glycol, found in some plant-based meat products. This chemical is derived from petroleum and is also a primary ingredient in antifreeze. Nine, carrageenan. Used as a thickener and emulsifier in many processed foods, carrageenan has been controversial due to concerns about its potential inflammatory effects. Ten, bone char, used in refining sugar. Bone char is derived from animal bones, making some sugars non-vegan and raising health concerns. These ingredients are often found in processed vegan foods and can detract from the health benefits typically associated with a plant-based diet. Are there any vegan products that are marketed as healthy but contain unhealthy ingredients? List brand names. Here are some brand names and products mentioned. One, frozen fake meats. Products like no chicken chicken nuggets are often high in sodium and may contain artificial ingredients, preservatives, and processed oils. Two, vegan deli meats. Brands like Tofurky and Light Life offer meat-free alternatives that can be high in sodium. However, Tofurky is noted for having highly recognizable ingredients. And light life chickpea and red pepper veggie deli slices are recommended for their veggie forward combinations. Three, vegan desserts. These products often substitute butter and eggs with starches, gums, and pectins, which can negatively affect the nutritional quality of the desserts. Four, plant based milks. Some brands contain emulsifiers and additives to prevent separation, making them more processed. Examples include various brands that might not specifically list unhealthy ingredients, but are noted for added processing agents. These examples highlight that while products are marketed as vegan and presumably healthier, they can still contain ingredients that are not ideal for health. Such as high levels of sodium, sugars, and artificial additives. Overall, what is the main problem of unhealthiness in vegan products? The main problem of unhealthiness in vegan products is the presence of unhealthy ingredients and nutritional deficiencies that can arise from a poorly planned vegan diet. Key issues include. One highly processed ingredients. 
Many vegan products, especially meat and cheese substitutes, are highly processed and can contain unhealthy levels of sodium, artificial additives, and unhealthy fats. Two nutritional deficiencies. Vegan diets can lead to deficiencies in essential nutrients such as vitamin B12, iron, calcium, omega, three fatty acids, and zinc because these are primarily found in animal products. These deficiencies can cause serious health issues like anemia, neurological problems, and bone density loss if not properly managed through diet and supplements. Three, over reliance on soy. Some vegan diets heavily rely on soy products, which can contribute to excessive intake of phytoestrogens and potentially lead to hormonal imbalances. Additionally, non-organic soy products may contain GMOs and higher levels of pesticides. Four, caloric insufficiency and energy levels. Vegan diets can sometimes be lower in calories, leading to energy deficiencies if not properly balanced with adequate caloric intake from a variety of food sources. Five, potential for unhealthy vegan junk foods. Vegan diets can include junk food that is just as unhealthy as non-vegan options, containing high levels of sugar. Salt and fat, and lacking in essential nutrients. These factors underscore the importance of careful planning and consideration when following a vegan diet to ensure it is balanced, nutritionally adequate, and free from excessive processed foods. What are some tips for incorporating mindfulness into vegan eating habits? One. Eat real food in its most natural form. Choose whole, unprocessed foods that are close to their natural state to maximize nutritional benefits and enhance the mindful eating experience. Two, be present and savor your food. Take the time to appreciate the colors, textures, smells, and flavors of your food. Chew slowly and without distractions to fully experience each bite. Three, practice gratitude before eating. Pause to express gratitude for the food in front of you and consider the journey it took to reach your plate. This can foster a deeper appreciation for your meal and the resources that went into it. Four, listen to your body's signals. Pay attention to your body's hunger and fullness cues. Eat when you're hungry and stop when you're satisfied, rather than eating out of habit or emotion. Five. Avoid restrictive eating. Don't restrict yourself from enjoying a variety of foods. Restrictive eating can lead to malnutrition and is not conducive to a mindful relationship with food. Six. Limit distractions. Try to eat without the interference of technology or other distractions. This can help you focus on your meal and the act of eating. Seven. Educate yourself. Learn about the nutritional content and health benefits of the foods you are eating. This knowledge can enhance your mindfulness and intentionality when choosing what to eat. Eight. Create a sacred space for meal times. Designate a specific area for eating that is calm and free from distractions. This can help turn meal time into a more intentional and enjoyable experience. Nine. Engage all your senses. Use all of your senses to engage with your food. Notice the sound of crunching, the aroma of spices, and the texture of each ingredient. Ten. Reflect on your food choices. Consider how your food choices align with your values, such as compassion towards animals and environmental sustainability, which are central to veganism. Eleven. Incorporate mindfulness practices. Regular mindfulness practices like meditation, 
Yoga or mindful walking can help cultivate a more mindful approach to eating and living in general. By integrating these mindful eating practices into your daily routine, you can enhance your connection with food, improve your overall well-being, and more closely align with veganism's principles. Thank you for tuning in almost to the conclusion of this podcast. Now, on to the special question. Some listeners have raised the notion that this podcast might be driven by artificial intelligence. Indeed, the voices you hear are generated by my Microsoft Word program, which processes compiled research and reads it aloud. Here's my query. Do you find this format engaging? And would you like me to continue with it? To my YouTube family, friends, and viewers, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments. Your ongoing support means the world to me in this YouTube podcasting journey. Moving forward, I'm eager to expand my audience. Please let me know what topics you'd like me to delve into to enhance the appeal of this podcast. Your feedback is invaluable, and I appreciate you listening and supporting me along the way. Don't forget to explore my temporary blog site, where you'll find all the show notes, relevant internet links, and a speakpipe feature allowing you to leave a voice comment of up to 90 seconds. Thank you for being a part of this journey. It at ltveganlivingpodcast.blogspot.com Dot com. Tune into our next episode. Forty-two nutritional needs. I need you to help support my podcast. How about gifting me five dollars if you like this podcast? Why not buy me a cup of coffee? The address will be in the show notes. The music featured at the beginning and end of this podcast is courtesy of Danmark Music Group. The opening and closing tracks are from the instrumental album "Beautiful Days" by Darren Birch, released under the title "Mononymous: The Best of Darren Birch Instrumental Songs" in 2019 via Darren Birch Music. The composer is Darren Birch. I aim for accuracy, but medicine evolves and approaches may differ. My views are evidence-based yet open to feedback and new insights. No pharmaceutical or medical company funding ensures an unbiased perspective. However, this content isn't medical advice. Consult your physician for personalized guidance on health concerns. The music featured at the beginning and end of this podcast is courtesy of Danmark Music Group. The opening and closing tracks are from the instrumental album "Beautiful Days" by Darren Birch, released under the title "Mononymous." The best of Darren Birch instrumental songs in 2019 via Darren Birch Music. The composer is Darren Birch. I aim for accuracy, but medicine evolves and approaches may differ. My views are evidence-based yet open to feedback and new insights. No pharmaceutical or medical company funding ensures an unbiased perspective. However, this content isn't medical advice. Consult your physician for personalized guidance on health concerns.